Lux and a little bit ghetto. <laughs> so in the morning, I cleanse my face with Dermalogica and then I use an eye cream and then my day cream is B Brow Bar Rose Day Cream. I went through a stage when I was 13 and I hated the world and I bought this black eyeshadow from Boots and I'd just get that, you know the tiny little brush and I'd smear it all over my eyes and not even blend it, I'd just put on a huge block on my eyes and then I'd probably wear like 12 coats of mascara so my lashes were so clumpy and stuck together but I actually thought I looked amazing. <laughs> Okay, anyone who knows me knows it's going to be Tupac. That's like my dream guy. I know he's not alive, but okay, him. But if it's someone that's alive now, um, I love Drake, ASAP Rocky, uh, Shy Glizzy. Who else? I like pretty much most of the rappers out there right now. Oh God, this is an embarrassing question. I don't really want to answer that. <laughs> Um, let's just say my mum, I don't know. <laughs> Literally yesterday, I'm not even exaggerating, yesterday. I think I didn't call her. I think, yeah, she had a go at me about that. She called me to tell me that. Flats, well, okay. I do have a lot of heels, but I just save it for special occasions, events, but every day I'm obsessed with trainers, so yeah, trainers, definitely. Probably London, because even when I go to New York, I always have fun and I go out there a lot, but whenever I come home, it's just like, I'm, I'm such a British girl, I just love England too much. Probably my friend Iman, she's a model too, so. We always just have funny jokes about when we're on set. Probably by my mum. When I was younger, she raised us on our own, so she's always telling us advice and how to be in life. And her main thing is just working hard. Stay humble, never forget where I came from, and just enjoy what I'm doing, because not everyone has this opportunity. Okay, I went on holiday like two weeks ago but this time it felt surreal going because I kept saying to my booker like are you sure I'm allowed to go because every other time I had to miss it to do the Burberry show so all my family would be abroad and I'd be in the show and they'd like watch on the live stream. <laughs> Probably like Bora Bora or the Maldives just like an island where there's no wi-fi no shops just complete chill out like no, I would survive. Seriously, I would. It's a hassle. Um, for a week, I wouldn't die. YSL mascara, uh, Burberry blush. It's it's like buildable, so you can um, use it on your lips as well. And then I took Blink eyebrow gel. I really like department stores. I like walking around Liberty and Fennec and just like getting lost and finding all the products myself. Probably still in Coventry. <laughs> I'd be in uni studying psychology and I'd be working my ass off to make sure I get a first because that's always been one of my dreams. And I'd be saving up for like I don't know, probably like a designer bag on the side as well. That's what I always used to do. <laughs> I want to buy a house for my mum. I want to be happy and I want to have a boyfriend. Let's just be real. <laughs> yes, that's one of my things. <laughs>